Uh, yes, yeah, it's, it's always good to, to get across the strip and I think uh, the last three weeks I've, I've gained a lot of confidence, especially um, the Bulldogs game on the weekend, to, to get two is, is always good and sort of put us in good stead for the game, which is great. Pretty unusual play the same team two weeks in a row, what have you learned from that game that you helped you down? They come home pretty strong, um, they, the last 20 minutes they've put some points on us, so I think um, as a club, we, we can learn from that and sort of I think it's something probably that we needed because we were pretty comfortable at the time and it looked like um, that we were going to put 40 odd points on them, but they come up strong and I think uh, we can look at the video and sort of see where we went wrong there and hopefully um, make it a lot better this weekend. Do you have to get a little intensity, you think, or now that now this final season? Yeah, we, we spoke about that this morning. Um, sort of a few goals that we set during the year, I think we've got to, we've got to step it up again. Because after after this weekend, there's only going to be six teams left, and I think um, the more intense and, and the better percentages that you can get, I think um, will will put you in good stead for the next couple of weeks. You've had a pretty rough 12 to 18 months. What does it mean to you to get to this stage and actually be part of finals football after the last 12 months? Uh, I'll, I'll be definitely nervous running out there, um, but I think it's more rewarding than anything. I've worked hard to where I've got to, and. Uh, I had a pretty up and down year um, this year, uh, a couple of games with the young guns, but I think I, I needed that and to get my confidence back and, and the last three weeks is probably the best that I've felt all year, so I'm hitting a bit of form at the right time of the year and I'm a lot more confident now that, than I was at the start of the season, so it's, it's good and probably more rewarding than anything. So yeah, with the injuries, problems you had last year, uh, you mentioned <coughs> up and down year this year, is it sort of taking you time to find your feet? Yeah, yeah, it has. It's um, the first couple of games that I played in grade. I felt felt pretty good, but then um, it was more tiredness in the body and probably mentally as well that I hadn't played for a year and me, I knew in my head that I was I was good enough to play, but my legs and that wouldn't wouldn't let me go. So I just needed time in the paddock, I think. And I think with Muzz um, dropping me back to, to young guns, it got me confidence back. And I think um, I was filthy at the time that it, that it did happen, but now that. I look back, I think he's, he's done the right thing, it's made me a lot more confident. So was that the hardest thing about coming back, just getting the body readjusted, was it? Yeah, it was, because I, I was used to doing all the rehab stuff, but I wasn't used to running for 80 minutes, like constantly, and I think um, with the time of the young guns, I, I got a free rein in there to do what I wanted, and to, to roam and that, so, and I felt a lot more confident when I, when I did come back in a couple of weeks ago, which was good. I think you mentioned you've been happy with the way you've gone the last three games, how do you think you sort of back to your, your best now, do you think? Yeah, I'm not far off it or anything. Um, it's sort of, it's slowly built over the last couple of weeks. Uh, the Dragons and Newcastle and then last week to get over the line was, was pretty good, but I'm um, starting to form a pretty good combination with Ash Graham and starting to be pretty comfortable on that right edge, which is something that's going to help me out as we go into the finals, I think. And heading into the finals, um, you were here in 2004, 2005. Can you uh, compare the, the feeling? Uh, I'm, I'm a couple of years older, um, I know a bit more, and I think um, I think I'm going to enjoy it a lot more because I'm not as nervous, and especially as a club, we sort of we've experienced that before. So I think I'm going to pass on a little bit to a few of the younger guys that, that have never been in before, and say uh, they get nervous, but I enjoy it because you never know what's going to happen again. Happen again, and I think a lot of us were a lot more filthy sitting down last year watching finals. And I think it's more of a relief to be there again this year. And especially at home, Sammy, it's, it's going to be something special for us and the North Queensland. It's been mentioned uh, Ty, the, the Tigers game uh, five or six weeks ago is a bit of a turning point in the season. And you may not have played in that game, but uh, do you think that was a turning yeah, point? Yeah, um, well, actually, I was travelled as 18th man in that game, and I sat on the sidelines and sort of. It was, it was hard. It was hard to, to swallow to watch like my fellow mates getting touched up like that. But I think um, a few stern words are said after the game by not only by players but coaching staff, and sort of we had a, had a bit of an honesty test with each other. And I think um, had that talent that we did get at Leichhardt has made us a better side. We won five on the trot, you know. And I think um, we've learned a lot from that, and I think that'll make us a better football side coming in the finals. Thanks, sweet. Thank you.